Temperatures keep creeping up and so are thefts around central New York. This morning, News Channel 9 is putting you on the lookout for these thieves. Put on your detective hats. We've got electric toothbrushes flying off a drugstore shelf, purse snatchers making the rounds at a golf course, and a call to check your home security cameras for a would-be burglar. <laughs> In Manlius, a home security camera on Stratus Circle near Pride Lane, close to the high school, briefly catches this guy who got near a window and cut a screen. That's as far as he got July 24th around 9.30 at night. Maybe your ring camera caught something more. Check and call Manlius Police. Cicero Police are trying to drum up some leads on this pair, who they say stole a woman's purse from her car Saturday afternoon at Northern Pines Golf Club on Route 31. It was off to Walmart and Target with her credit cards to go on a $2,000 shopping spree. One man's a Yankee fan, the other was wearing a multicolored hoodie. They took off in a red sedan, light window tint, chrome trim around the windows. Drugstore managers are bristling over this next case. Cicero police are trying to identify this toothbrush bandit. They say this man was caught on camera Saturday at Kinney Drugs in Bridgeport, putting $345 worth of electric toothbrushes in his pants. He drove off in this white Chevy Cruze. You'll make Cicero police smile if you could ID him. There's no end to convincing scam calls. This week, scammers are posing as the Drug Enforcement Administration. It might even show up as the DEA uh, when they call. Uh, if there's various types of scams, what revolves around is that either you owe money, there's been accounts opened up in your name. If you don't make these accounts right, you're going to go to jail. They're spoofing numbers of all kinds, even Syracuse police. I've had that personally happen to me, where someone pretended they were calling from the Syracuse Police Department, called me, and were going to threaten me with arrest if I didn't pay a bill. Follow the lieutenant's lead. Hang up. And properly buckling kids into car seats can be tricky, but it's a vital safety measure all parents should master. Camilla's police are offering some help this Saturday morning from 8 until noon at Rise and Grind in Camilla's. With this On the Lookout Roundup, I'm Christy Casciano.